Okay, everybody. How's it going today? Now, I'm using a webcam to explain this because it's really all I have to record something outside of the computer. So, I'm going to explain today what I use to record stuff off my video, my my uh, PlayStation 2, and all that. I'm going to show how I have that and turn that into a video on YouTube. Okay. All right. There we are. A certain, there are a certain, let's just turn down here, there are a certain th amount of things that you need to actually do this, alright? The number one thing that you need is something called a dazzle. And my hand's going in slow motion to grab it. But yeah, back up a little bit, yeah. That is a dazzle. Okay, you see it? That's a dazzle. This hooks up to your computer by USB cable. You will notice on one end, I have a red, a red one and a white cable and a yellow cable. You need to buy you about a, at least a six foot long cable, at least, from Walmart or somewhere like that. And once you buy that, that that end goes into the dazzle. The other end, if you'll follow it, here's here's the cable still. It's going all the way to my TV, right here. Okay, sorry that the, again, I'm sorry for the crappy quality of this video, but this is the only way I can explain this, because I'm getting asked so many times how I do this, and so I'm going to explain it the best I can. Alright, that end goes in here. But yeah, i got to explain something else now. You need to see whether or not your TV has an input and an output, meaning we see my TV... You'll see, if, if you can see it, it'll say right here, mine says video in, and then left audio and right audio. You see, my TV only has an input. I've looked all over the TV. That's the only thing it has is an input. So, but if your TV has an input and an output, one end of your dazzle, let's just say here's the end of your dazzle. All right. Well, there's your dazzle right here. One end of the red, white, and yellow cable that you bought from Walmart goes in there, while the other one goes into the output of your television set. Okay. Now, your video game, when you hook that one up, that one goes into your input. You see, I've got my game into my input right now, too. All right. So you'll notice, you're wondering how, well, then how in the heck are you recording if you do not have an output, because... The output cable is where the dazzle goes into, I mean the output is where the dazzle goes into, and the input's where your video game system goes into. Well, I'm going to explain that, how you fix that. What you need to buy, if your TV only has an input, what you need to buy is something called a Y cable, as in the letter Y. A Y cable is what it's called. They look like this. Let me take one out. All right. That is a Y cable. See, there's the end. That goes into your input of your TV. And you'll notice on the bottom side, there are two ends to it. That's why it's called a Y cable, because it's got one end on one end and two ends on the other. And you'll notice that I have two red, um, two red audio cables put into that Y cable, which then goes into your TV right here into my input. You see what the Y cable does is it transforms your TV into an input and an output. It gives it both. And so what you have to do is get you three three Y cables. You can't do it with one. You have to have three. Okay? So go to Walmart, buy you three Y cables. Now this is only if you only have an input on your TV. If you have both input and output, you do not have to buy the Y cables. Okay, but you see, I only have an input, so I have to have the Y cables. Okay, yeah. Now, one like here. You need to get three, like I said. Now, you put your Y cables, the one that only, the side that only has one end. You go ahead and put that into your TV. Okay. Now, like I said, each Y cable has two ends. One end is for the dazzle to go into. The other end is for the video game system to go into. 
Now it doesn't matter which one you put it into as long as they're both red and they're going to the same Y cable. You can't have a red one on this Y cable and then decide to put the Dazzle one in another Y cable because that's just going to screw things up. You need to make sure. See, this one's for the red out is for the red audio cable. And so there's the two ends. There's my two reds going to it. One for my Dazzle, one for my video game system. Same goes for my Watt, my Watt audio cable. Two of them goes to that single Y cable, goes to my Watt, my Watt input. Same goes for the video. Got two there. One's for my Dazzle, one's from my PlayStation 2. Goes to the input of your television. Okay? Now, do y'all understand that? Remember, if your TV only has an input, it'll say on your TV if it's input or output. Look on the back side of your TV, and if you see one that says output, then there you go. You have an output. And then there should be another one that says input. The input, you put your PlayStation 2 or whatever video game system you own, that goes into your input, which I'm sure you already know that. And it's quite self-explanatory. The Dazzle, you put that into your output. That way, it will send whatever you're playing on your PlayStation 2. It'll send it through the out, through the input, show it on the TV screen, and then whatever's on your TV screen will come out the output part of your TV and travel along to the Dazzle, which in turn goes to your computer screen, where you can record it using Windows Movie Maker. It's quite simple, really. All right, I don't think there's anything else I can really explain, but remember. If you only have an input, you need to buy Y cables. Three of them. Do not forget that. Okay. That is everything you need to record something off your TV. Now, the Dazzle, which is on the floor right now. I got a lot of cables on the floor right now because I have to in order to record stuff. But, yeah. The Dazzle, do not worry about getting the Platinum. I know a lot of people have the Platinum because I'm sure it's better quality but if you'll see my latest videos using this Dazzle, you'll notice that they're just fine. There's really nothing wrong with them. So yeah, the regular Dazzle costs, I'd say, 40 to 50 bucks, maybe 60, depending on where you go. So it's not that expensive, but you know, it's a good pocket change. The Platinum Edition is like $100, so I don't know if you really want to spend that much. Who knows? This could be the Platinum Edition. I really do not know if I bought the Platinum or not. This could be the Platinum Edition, but I'd figure it would say Platinum on it, but it doesn't. So I'm not quite sure if it is or not. But yeah, I hope this video helped you out in telling you what you need and what you need to get. Remember that the Dazzle does not come with your own red, white, and yellow cable. You have to buy one from Walmart. A six foot would be plenty. I wouldn't get it too short because you have to be sure to have plenty of room to move your Dazzle around and all that kind of junk. But yeah. Just remember, gotta get a dazzle, buy a six foot cable at least, a red, white, and yellow cable, buy three, right here, buy three Y cables, which are going into my input right now, and then my dazzle and my PlayStation 2 is going into both ends of the Y cables. Remember, you gotta have three. I know I'm repeating myself, but people, it's, it's the best way to get someone to understand something if you repeat yourself. That's how you're supposed to teach, is by repeating yourself so people will be sure to know what you're talking about. Now, that's pretty much it for this video. I have a video already on YouTube. I think it's Let's See How I Do Things, part three or four. I'm not sure if I have a fourth part, but one of the, it's, one, it's the last part. I'm actually explaining how to use Windows Movie Maker. So, yeah, you shouldn't have a problem with that part. I'm not going to make a video on that yet. This video is the main video, is the main question. What's on this video is what I get asked the most through my PMs, is how do I do this? And so hopefully this will help you. And I know this is a long video, but you have to go slow to explain stuff sometimes. So yeah, I hope this helped you. If you still do not know how to use Windows Movie Maker, once you get the Dazzle and everything, there are videos out there, I promise you. This is how I figured it out. That's how I figured out how to get the Y cables. I looked on YouTube. I did a little research. But there's people out there that don't know how to research. They're honestly too lazy to look for themselves. I don't want to be mean. But there are videos out there already to explain this. And there's, there's, a, lot, there's a lot of them out there that are much better quality than this video. So yeah. 
but I explained it the best I can using a crappy webcam and luckily you can see everything pretty good decently enough you can't expect much from a webcam but I hope everyone has a good day and I hope this video helped out so till the next time you hear from me guys later